made every mob into skibidi toilet in minecraft now this sounds crazy he remakes every single mob in minecraft into a skibidi toilet character so uh that's what we're watching today i thought it could be really interesting and i thought y'all would also find it interesting because i'm like what is this so uh let's check it out and see what's going on because i grew up on minecraft i love skibidi toilet so it's a match made in heaven let's go i'm going to be remaking minecraft mobs into skibidi toilet uh, the first that like speaker I'll man is a regular toilet and easy use a villager you'll see why so use like a villager head are we gonna get to see the creative process too hold on hold on hold on first on. let's delete all this stuff because we easy need it. And, and then you just make a toilet you've been to the bottom of the toilet let's color it white oh. Oh we'll dang, that's creative. More circular. Now let's expand oh, wow. up a little bit more, and we'll put some blue. I also like how the video is very fast paced too. That makes yo, he's this is a great, great content creator already. Toilet water inside of the bowl. Now let's use the villager head as the head. I'll obviously fix the texture later. And I'll just. I've always hated how like 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 villagers had like the Squidward nose, like, and then they make that sound. Why are you? Why are you doing that? The back of the toilet like this, and I'll also make the toilet seat in front of it as well. Now let's color all this in, and we'll fix the villager head texture. Nice. Now Let's put a little flush button on the nice. back like this. And now our toilet is pretty much done. I just about to do this. For this guy, just yeah, I was like about to say, you gotta do that. You gotta do the, 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 the schizo. The actual series. The little... yeah, that looks pretty good. Let's add it to the game. This is how the skibbity toilet looks in game. It also looks cool. really good. He got a skibbity toilet mod? Maybe we do a skibbity toilet Minecraft? The only real gaming channel? problem i see is this weird spot on the neck here but that doesn't really matter in the actual series when a toilet dies there's a flush animation so i added that to this toilet as well oh yeah he oh also that's so tough that's disgusting Those are please stop cut it beans. out yeah 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 the skibbity toilet is also hostile towards players because a player is technically a cameraman. This is what happens when you don't subscribe. You get chased <laughs> by toilets. Overall, I think the skibbity toilet turned out pretty good, so I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. Now, that's a 10 out of 10, my boy. That's about as good as it's going to get, you know, besides, you know, making your own texture for the skin, but just using a villager normally and making a toilet. I mean, that's as good as it gets. I don't I don't see any flaw within it. Maybe that black spot in the neck, but even then, who's really complaining about that? You even got the animation with the cocoa beans. That's an excellent 10 out of 10. Now, obviously our toilets need an enemy other than me, so next I'm gonna make a cameraman. And I'll use a zombie since zombies hate villagers. We'll start by making a little shoe that, down that here. Makes sense. And now we'll start to give him a leg. Now let's copy the leg over to the other side. That's and hard. Now let's work They're skinny legs, boy. On his body. Built like Slenderman. I'm gonna build like... Okay, let me stop. Some long arms like this. And now I'm gonna start He's to really built like Slenderman. shape the camera on his head. Let's just put some walls around the lens like this. And then we'll give him That's the hard. headphones that he wears as well. Now it's time to color this guy in. Let's Let's start by coloring the edges of the camera and then we'll color some parts of his suit black and now let's just add some details to his suit as well yep. the cameraman i'm looking at also seems to be wearing a coat so let's give him that as well now let's just add a little bit of texture to him and i think that looks good let's add him to the game this is our cameraman in that's game. not bad he actually looks pretty cool okay i don't really know why he doesn't stop walking that's a problem okay i fixed the walking issue by giving him this idle animation and he also has another animation which is this thumbs up animation that's uh that that's how that's how that's how like something else though obviously the cameramen in the skibbity toilets naturally fight each other and the fight is actually really even come on cameraman you can it shouldn't be that even but then again the cameraman don't got a gun so yeah win this oh yeah i made the cameraman drop a command block because i didn't know what to give him you can also watch a fight from inside the cameraman since he's a cameraman that's this hard is definitely not yeah, just that's a cool. feature that exists for every mob i decided to give the cameraman a six out of ten i know i'm supposed to be on his team but i don't like him as much as the toilet next i'll make a strider toilet and let's oh my god, he's gonna make the long ding a dong. Holy sh! He's a spider because he kind of looks like a spider. First, let's remove everything except. So first we'll do that, and now we'll just give him a creepy mouth, and we'll uh, also just give him some shading on his head. And that looks kind of cursed, but that's yo, what- Yo, that is- yeah, that's cursed. He forgot the long dong silver in the middle of the legs, but it's all good. I'm gonna let it slide. We wanted. Let's see him in game. This is the spider toilet in game. He kind of looks like the Joker. The spider toilet is also insanely fast compared to the other mobs, which doesn't really help him look less scary. Like, look at him chasing like that is, yeah, that's almost a horror mob. Yeah. The strider toilet is also a lot stronger than a regular toilet, as he's able to take on two cameramen at the same time. 
Only one player, though. He definitely didn't almost kill me. Oh, yeah. I also made it so you can ride him. because Oh, that's hard. Him. That's so, so cool. I think that's I'm cool. The rider toilet is 7 out of 10, just like the regular toilet. Because he isn't any more interesting. But the mobs are about to get more interesting. Because next, I'm going to make the Titan Speaker Man. And I'm using a Vindicator because they also hate villagers. First, I'm going to use Makes the same sense. leg I made for the cameraman. <clears throat> and just copy it here. And then we'll change the shape of his body a bit. But he has to be tall, though. It's a Titan. And give him some better looking arms. Now, let's start to color what we have so far. We'll make the pants dark gray, just like on the cameraman. And then we'll color the shoes black as well. Now, we'll just color his arms and chest red for now. And then we'll work on making his speakers. I'm going to make the speakers with no texture first to see how they look. And I think that's some pretty good speakers. So, let's just color them all black. And now, we'll start to add the actual speaker parts with the red ones first. And right. we'll also add a few gray ones as well. Now, we can make the red thing that comes out of his chest like this. And we'll also add his plasma blaster on the side of his arm. Hard. Now, we'll just add some texture Hard. all around him to make him look a little bit nicer. And that's the Titan Speaker Man complete. Let's see how he looks in game. This is the Titan Speaker That's tough. And he got the little... Yeah. Yeah, he did that. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he did that. He did that. He did that. Man in game. Wow. It's definitely a little bit bigger than a cameraman. I also decided to give him a boss bar so you know that he's a big deal. If any type of toilets get within range of the Titan Speaker Man, he shoots powerful. That's amazing. Bombs at you can tell they're really powerful because he almost died from his own attacks. If the Titan Speaker Man does manage to die, he will drop a note block. And I would play the Speaker Man song right now, but I don't really want to get copyrighted. True. The Titan Speaker Man is honestly my favorite mob right now, and because of that, we're going to give him a nine out of ten. Yeah, he's amazing. What it out the titan He's speaker amazing. man got infected so let's make that next i used a wandering trader as the base but that doesn't really matter because why don't you just take the same thing just add blue electricity we've already made the titan speaker man we just have to add a few details to make him infected like this yellow light instead of red and we'll also add some blue stuff to show yeah. he's infected okay never mind we'll get rid of that this is the infected speaker man in game it was honestly kind of hard to tell the difference between the two so i added these particles to make him look infected oh yeah and there's also a different boss bar as well yeah that no one is looking at that anyway one one difference between the infected and regular speaker man is that the infected one can fly. I don't know if he's supposed to be able to do that, but it definitely makes their fight more interesting. Their fight also makes no sense because there can't be two titan speaker men at once. Okay, the infected speaker man is way too OP because he can fly. Yeah, he can fly. I'm going to give the infected speaker man a 9 out of 10 as well because they're basically pretty good. the same thing. Next, I'll make the TV fight. woman. And I'm going to use a witch to make her. Let's remove all this stuff. And now we can make- She can set people on fire. I'm interested to see how he does that. Bottom of her leg. Let's color her shoe black. And then we'll add the how was he gonna do that? As well. How? We can copy How? The leg over to How? The side, and now How? Let's work on her body. First, I'm gonna make her a bit taller, and let's put her arms behind her back. Now we can color her shirt black. Oh yeah, she does walk like that. Well, arms. not always. And now that looks pretty good, but obviously we have to change this head. So let's make it into the shape of a TV like this, and we'll color this outside part dark black. Now let's color the inside a light That's shade of blue. That's so tall. Antennas. Now finally, let's just add some texture all around her body, and I think that looks really good. Let's add her to. That's the decent. Where the purple at? Game. This is how the TV woman looks in game. She actually looks really good. I also don't know if you noticed, but I made her switch between nothing and the face she does every few seconds. The TV oh, woman hard. has less health than the Titan Speaker Man, but her attack is much yeah, faster. This means she's, that when wow, fight, she's different. Why is she? She's OP. It's actually kind of close. It also means she can take out a bunch of toilets at once, and they literally can't do anything. I also that, that's the canon. TV that's facts. Teleport away when she gets low on that's facts. In the actual series, she doesn't really teleport that far away, but that's so the fight remains fair. If you kill the TV woman, she drops a piece of glass from her TV screen, which is pretty useless, but it makes sense. And she also makes witch noises all the time, which is kind of funny. I'm going to give the TV woman a 10 out of 10. I think she turned up- Nah, there was no- I, I don't agree. I think it's like uh, 8 out of 10 because for, I think the antennas are a little too long and a little too robust. Maybe that's just Roblox and also- the outfit. I don't know. I'm just a stickler for like fashion. So yeah. Oh, really good. Next, I'm going to make. But like the overall, just toilet. model is and 10 since out of 10. I used 10. a villager for the regular toilet. It only makes sense to use an iron golem for this one. Let's start by deleting everything except the head. And now let's paste the head onto a toilet body like this. Now, obviously, the G-Man toilet isn't the same color as the regular toilets, so let's just color them in. And now this is a pretty good base, so let's start adding some detail. The G-Man toilet has these orange glasses, so let's just give them to our iron golem as well. And we can also add the headphones. He wears as well. Give, now, give him the high top feet. The toilet more reinforced, and we're also gonna add the dark gray shields he has all around his body like this. And that is looking pretty good. Now let's add. Nah, that lasers. is hard. The G-Man toilet has give some hair in total, so that's how many I added on our toilet as well. Now for some final details, let's add some more reinforcement to the back of the toilet, and we can also add some texture to the accessories we just gave him. And we're done with the G-Man skibbity toilet. Let's add him to the. Oh, I really want him to have hair, but that's hard. This is the G-Man toilet. Watch in the game. Day, he's huge. 
we've made so far. The G-Man Toilet is also by far the most powerful mob we've made so far. He's basically able to insta-kill the TV Woman and the Titan Speaker Man doesn't do much yeah, that's way too broken. Either. I thought that I could take out the G-Man Toilet, but it also didn't go well for me either. He is too good. If you kill a G-Man Toilet, he drops a Totem of Undying because I didn't really know what to make him draw. I also like how he makes an Iron Golem sound when you hit him. It actually fits him. Honestly, the G-Man Toilet is one of the best looking mobs I've made yeah, so far. Yeah, it's tough. And because of that, I decided to give him a 10 out of 10. I think he just, you could just add some hair to the top, gang. You could just put some black up there. It'll make it so much more yeah. realistic. The only problem is that he's too powerful. We need someone that's able to Oh, wait, him. I forgot. These are like mixed with mobs. I forgot. So it's like supposed to be like a 50-50 kind of thing. So, okay, okay. So next, I'll make the Titan TV Titan TV man looks in game. That's decent. He's honestly not as intimidating as I thought. Don't let that trick you though, because he's definitely the most powerful mob yet. Okay, there might be a slight problem with his walk. I feel like it shouldn't look like that. Similar to the TV woman, I made it so his face changes every few seconds. That's hard. I also made it so he teleports away when he gets low as well. Although I don't think that's happening. This is what happens when the Titan TV man fights the G-Man. Oh toilet. yeah, he's so I don't think the toilet had any chance. Maybe like five of them could kill him. Nope, not even five of them can do that. I decided to give the titan tv man an 8 out of 10 even though he's really powerful i don't think he looks as he good just feels so thin like i feel like he should be more robust as the others subscribe if you want me to make more skibbity mobs all right man that was that was making every mob into skibbity toilet if you guys enjoyed this make sure you guys like if you got to the end of the video let me know because i want to do there's like four parts and i want to do them if this video does good we'll definitely do all the parts so thank you guys so much for watching uh yeah, man, he killed that video. That was that was amazing, amazing. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next one, bro. Peace out.